Good morning po sa bawat isa na nandito sa sanctuary. Good morning! Ay, Marina, paklakasan po. Good morning! Yan. Good morning din po. Good afternoon and good evening sa mga naka-online. I believe all of us are excited and ready to worship God this morning. Amen? Amen. As we come here every Sunday po, we should always have an expectant heart that God will do something good. Because tandaan po natin, what we expect is what we will get. Kaya nga po, isang malakas na palakpak sa ating Panginoong Yesus. Yung palakpak po para kay Jesus. Amen and amen. Pakisabi po sa inyong katabi, you are blessed. Sige po, sa kanya po sabihin, hindi sa akin. Yan. Sa kabila naman po, you are healed. Yan. We should always declare positive words sa ating buhay, sa ating mga pamilya, sa ating mga anak. Because the word of God says in Matthew chapter 16, verse 19, it says, Whatever you bind on earth, heaven will bind it. Whatever you lose on earth, heaven will lose it. Sabi din po sa Proverbs 18, verse 21, Life and death lie in the power of the tongue. That as we declare the power of God's word, it becomes a reality in our lives. Amen po ba? And even as we read the word of God, Let's declare His power in our lives. As I request everyone po to please rise up. Tayo po tayong lahat. And let's open our Bibles in the book of Philippians chapter 3, verses 7 to 11. Philippians 3, verses 7 to 11. I'll be reading in the ESV translation. Yan. Sabay-sabay po nating basahin ang salita ng Panginoon with power, with faith, and with authority. Verse 7, tayo pong lahat. But whatever gain I had, I counted as loss for the sake of Christ. 8. Indeed, I count everything as loss because of the surpassing worth of Christ, of knowing Christ Jesus my Lord. For His sake, I have suffered the loss of all things and count them as rubbish in order that I may gain Christ. Verse 9, And be found in Him not having a righteousness of my own that comes from the law, but that which comes through faith in Christ, the righteousness from God that depends on faith. Verse 10, that I may know him and the power of his resurrection and may share his sufferings, becoming like him in his death. Verse 11, and that by any means possible, I may attain the resurrection from the dead. God bless the reading of His Word. Tayo pong lahat ay iyo ko. Let's all bow our heads and let's pray. Let's have a moment of silence to thank the Lord for all the things that He has done in our lives. God has been faithful to each and every one of us. Sige po, magpasalamat po tayo sa ating Panginoon. Lord God, we come to you this morning full of expectations, O God that we will encounter the God of the Bible. Dumating po kami dito, O Diyos, punong-puno ng pag-asa, nakakatagpuin po ninyo ang bawat isa na naririto. So sama po, O God, na dumating man po na may kabigatan ng puso, subalit naniniwala po kami, nalalabas po kami na may panibagong lakas at pag-asa. So sama po, we have come here, O God, who are sick, whether physically, emotionally or spiritually, we believe, O God, we will come out of this sanctuary healed, delivered, and victorious. We declare, O Father, the power of your word in our lives, that we are blessed, that we are healed, that we are highly favored, and that we are victorious. We believe in the power of your word in our lives, O God. And as your Holy Spirit moves mightily in our midst, O Lord. Ang tanging dalangin lang po namin, O Diyos, ang pangalan ng aming Panginoong Yesus ang siya lamang may taas at maluwalahati sa aming kalagitnaan. Kaya nga po, O Diyos, salamat po sa isang matagumpay na gawain sa umaga nito sapagkat ito po ang aming nagkakaisang panalangin sa pangalan ng aming Panginoong Yesus at kami pong lahat ay nagsabi ng malakas na 
Amen. Malakas na malakpak po sa Panginoon. Amen. Hallelujah. Let's continue to praise the Lord with gladness. Amen po ba? Let's give Him praise. Hallelujah, Jesus. You are worthy of our praise, O Lord.
maghari ka o Diyos sa aming buhay. Patuloy ka namin sinasamba sa oras at oras. Sa kapila ng aming mga pagkukulang, aming mga pagkakasala, Patuloy ang pag-ibig at pagmamahal sa amin, Diyos. Salamat sa kaligtasan na ipinagamang sa bawat sa amin. Salamat sa inyong pagkakas. Salamat sa susulong pinag
That despite of the many sins that we commit, and sometimes we still commit, God continue to reach out to us. And may I just request everyone to please, let's continue to appreciate and worship God as we sing this song. To love Him as He is reaching out to us, let's reach out to God this morning. Just feel the love of God upon your lives. That He cares for all of us. He cares for your situation. He cares for what you are undergoing right now. And that He can make a way in your life. That He can make a way in all of us. Everyone says, Amen and Amen. Sige po, malakas na malakpak sa ating Panginoon. Yan. Before we sit down po, uh, we'd like to, before we sit down, let's continue on standing po. We'd like to greet each and everyone po na dumating dito, especially our first timers. Kung meron po tayo, you are very much welcome here. And tayo naman po na nandito, let's just run around and as we sing this song to greet everyone po.
makakapuno na po tayo in the presence of the Lord. Yan. Ngayon po, ihanda na po natin ang ating mga kaloob, ang ating mga tithes and love offering as we give them to the Lord. Again, Mary Cross, everyone, to please bow our heads and let's pray. Tayo pong lahat muli ay manalangin. Lord God, whatever we have right now, our businesses, our jobs, Panginoon, everything comes from you. We all it out to you, O God, because it is you who give us the ability to get wealth, Panginoon. Salamat po, Panginoon, sa patuloy na provision po ninyo sa aming mga kanya-kanyang buhay, sa pag-aaral ng aming mga anak, sa aming mga kinakain sa bawat araw, maging odyo sa kalakasan ng aming mga physical na pangangatawan. It is you as well, O God, who give rest to those who are weary and heavily laden. And right now, O God, narito po ang aming mga handog, ang aming mga tithes, ang aming mga love offering, and even mga pledges, O Lord, as a sign of our love and our obedience to you. Tanggapin po ninyo ito, Panginoon, na galing po sa aming mga puso. At ang dalangin lang po namin, O Diyos, ay patuloy, magamit po ito, sa patuloy na ikalalawak, ikalalaganap pa ng iyong salita. Salamat po. Ito po ang aming panalangin sa pangalan ng Jesus. Ang lahat po ay nagsabi ng... Amen. Maari na po tayong magkaloob. Sa ating pong mga naka-online, nandiyan po sa ating screen, yung mga pwede po tayong magkaloob through online banking. God bless your church sa inyo pong pagbibigay sa ating gawain. Amen. Sa pagkapatuloy po natin, we have very few announcements po. Ayan, tinan po natin. Unang-una po, ayan, Christmas is just around the corner. As it is the tradition po ng Christ in your couples fellowship, you are inviting everyone po sa ating Christmas in November entitled with the theme Christmas in our hearts. Yeah, and that would be on November 24. That's Friday po, 6 p.m. dito sa CIY Main. I believe lahat po tayo excited yearly dito po. So, magantay-antay lang po kayo for further details to be announced next week. Again, Christmas in our hearts, Christmas in November. Okay, next po. Yung Radicals Youth, meron po silang November series entitled Broken. It's every Saturday, 3 p.m. Dito rin po sa CIY Main. Again, Radicals Youth, November series, Broken. Salamat ka sa tulad. 